there is one question i found on my last video the guy asked if he can set ad right and sell since he has more capital now here is my response to be honest you can set ad okay that way you can even sell more higher but the issue you may have is that ethereum might also decline in price generally you understand so in my last video a lot of you guys were asking me if this particular trade that i shared is working every time right now which is that it's worked every time it can make you money every single time if you understand how to do so now today we are going to go back and revisit this particular strategy and how it works but today's own it's going to be more extensive i'm going to explain it more to you guys so you can understand everything from beginning to the end so you just have to watch this video till the end so you can understand how this works and if it's something you can do it's kind of very very easy to do to be honest guys all you just have to know is to you know have your capital then watch this video and understand the process like i said guys i'll go now to my phone screen all right to show you guys this process and if it is worth something i'm gonna you know consider doing all right so here on my screen you can see this is by bit now the very first thing to do is just go to your you know having your money already then coming to the spot market okay i'm assuming at this time you already have your usdt already okay so coming to your spot market all you have to do is very simple when you are here you just have to come right here and you are going to be on this ethereum section now what you're going to be looking is the price ethereum is right here okay the price ethereum is selling at at this point right now as you can see here now ethereum is obviously selling at the rate of two thousand five sixty one dollars all right and if you check that in naira you should know how much it is okay it's about four million something but that's not what you're here to do basically let's first of all buy some ethereum that is the first thing okay now to do this like i said capital may be one of your problem but if you have from you know 50 dollars upward you can try this out okay but for most time that i've done this okay i use more than that to be honest all right so what you can do here so we want to just try this thing out with uh 200 dollars so this way we are going to understand what we are doing so from here i'm going to come okay uh, and i'll put here the the amount of usd i want to use which i'm going to put in here again 200 dollars if i put it right here look at the amount i'm going to be getting i'll be getting 0 0.07819 ethereum i'm going to copy it all right now all you have to do is simple after getting it here you go straight to your p2p section and sell you understand but when you are doing this this particular arbitrage or this particular coin which is ethereum is volatile right it is goes up it goes that is not stable so you need to be fast now there is one question i found on my last video the guy asked if he can set ad right and sell since he has more capital now here is my response to be honest you can set ad okay that way you can even sell more higher but the issue you may have is that ethereum might also decline in price generally you understand so selling more selling just in the correct market price is very much preferable for me you get but if you don't have that lot of money you should prefer to set ads then that's fine all right that's fine but like i said i prefer selling at what market is giving me at the moment you get now i just have to come back I copy this right here i just have to come back out of this place <coughs> then you go to your on your home page you go to find your p2p section which is uh, where i am right now okay click on the p2p section to bring you here so obviously what you have to do is just for you to look out for what where your ethereum is now remember we are not doing dealing with ptc at the moment so obviously you are dealing with ethereum so you just come here now and you change from this BTC you are seeing, right? You put it to Ethereum. It's as easy as that. Okay. So let me just do that. So you click on this drawdown to change this to Ethereum. All right. ETH. Now click on that. It will bring you here. Like I said, you can see the amount people are obviously, you know, buying this here. But we are going to go to the sell side straight off. Okay. Now on the sell side, 
I'm going to see a lot of ineligible, right? All these guys here, you can't sell to these ones. Do you understand? The reason is that, like I said before, I am not act actively using Bybit to trade. That's because I found another exchange that is more easier for me to navigate, which is BitGet. Do you understand? But for you, if you are that active on Bybit, you will miss the requirement. The requirement for most of these ineligible guys here is the number of trades. One of them is like, if you haven't got, gotten like 30 trades in a, in, a, in a week, sorry, in a month, you wouldn't be able to sell to them. Some of them is based on location. So if your location is not um, okay for them per se, you may not really sell to them. So now, here what I'm going to do, if you click on this first guy now, it says that your ass, your 30 days completed order are less than 60. So I can't sell to this guy just because my 30 days order is less than 60 on this platform, which is very, very understandable because I'm not active here. If I didn't even I'm that active here, like doing P2P, right? I would have passed this. But on BitGet, I'm that active. You understand? That is where I make most of my trades because they have a higher rate than uh, by, by, uh, by bit, right? So for that reason, I can't sell to this first guy. Even as that, because this first guy here, if I sell to him, to be honest, I'll make more money. You can even see that this guy is selling for 4 million eight hundred and eighty eight thousand naira. Very high. You get now this second guy. The reason I cannot sell to this guy now is you are not user from the country specified by the advertiser. So region is also something you, you understand. This issue you're gonna you know uh uh let's like say you're gonna face, yeah. Because this some people here now will not really advertise in your country is understandable okay you go so i'm in nigeria currently so maybe the person don't want people in nigeria to sell or buy from us right so he excluded our country from his list you get so that's why most of these guys here are ineligible it doesn't mean that you are not okay or you can't sell or something's wrong with your account no these, these are the reasons now if you scroll down you must find the one that are okay in your own region so if I scroll up now, I'm going to see people that I can easily sell to. Now you can see here, but this shirt you can see that this people here has lesser price to compare this for. This first guy you sell for four million eighty eight eight hundred and eight thousand. Now if you scroll down, this guy I'm eligible to sell is selling for right, he's buying his own for four million three hundred and thirty five thousand. So the price is a bit lower like about five hundred thousand naira difference if i should if you do it in naira can you see so the price is a bit lower but even, even in that case i can still sell to the guy and make profit to be honest now let's let's try that and see now if you come to this guy now right we click on him all right and we're going to see uh price have changed confirm that's what you, you know this thing price changes almost every time because you know it's a volatile coin like i explained but let's just go and see if I, we can so right now you click on this guy now so you can actually see here so let's use the price we are seeing here let's use the price we are seeing here okay because i don't have this money currently on this account if you see the price the guy is selling here is what four million three hundred twenty four thousand one oh one four million three hundred twenty four thousand one oh one four million three hundred twenty four thousand one oh one now let's use it for, as our mathematics here now for us to understand if this is profitable or not now remember if you bring your calculator now okay you are going to first of all you know the amount you buy do you understand the amount you buy is this all right this is the amount you buy is zero point this this thing now here so if you times it okay by four million three hundred twenty four thousand one hundred one, you are going to get thirty three hundred and thirty eight thousand hundred and one oh one that is three hundred eight thousand naira that is money you will receive from this particular seller if you sold all your ethereum to him because the guy is buying from you that's why his ad is on the sell side you get now if you now do because generally now the highest amount you can sell or you can buy usdt is at one thousand six seventy so if you do 1670 naira you times it by 200 you started this particular whole arbitrage with 
you will be start you, you will start you will see that you spend 334,000 even if you buy at three uh what like or 690 you wouldn't still this is how much you like okay let's 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 even add 1680 okay you times it by 200 you'll be spending 336,000 do you understand Let, let's use this one as an example now so here is the, here is the gist remember that what if if you sell our ethereum that we got okay for 4 million we times this thing for 4 million 324 right 101 right you're going to give us 38,000 if you minus this from the 6,000 you're going to receive let's say you even buy at that price 326 sorry that's uh, I made a mistake so let me do it properly again so we times this thing by 4 million 324 101 you give us this amount now you minus this from 336,000, 336, then you left with 2,000 naira. That is still profit. That's where it is interesting, right? So you don't really need to bother yourself much. The profit is already there. Just buy there and sell here. Okay, but like I said, you see people that are selling to you. Remember, sometimes the price fluctuates. Okay, you may come and almost see profit doing this. And if you have smaller amount of money, the prices will also change because these guys you are seeing here, honestly, these guys you are seeing here, they may not sell to you if you are not like some of them, their limit you can sell to them is you must have like from hundreds, 200, 300,000. Do you understand? So if you are doing it with 10,000, uh, 5,000, all those kind of money, the people you may see selling to here, their price may be very, very ridiculous, may be very, very low. So that's something. Okay, now let me show you what I mean here. If you come here and I say that your limit is 10,000, all right, the people you are going to see here, to be honest, their price will be very, very, very low. So this way, you can't even make money from those guys, to be honest. You can't even make money from those guys because your price, you, they will see them buying from you will be very, very, very low. You understand? And you may not be able to sell most of them. So you just need to have more. If you, like, if you have more money, you are going to see people that are going to buy in a higher price. I don't know if, I don't know if you are getting my... Their limit will be like... It's, some people's limit you can, is from 100,000 naira up. And if you don't have 100,000, you can't sell to them. If you have only 10,000, you can't sell to them. So, making, so this way, that's how it became a problem for people that do not have enough money to do this. All right? So if you are somebody that just starting out, all right, I, I, the only issue we're going to have in this particular arbitrage is you don't have enough money. We have money and half time, 2,000 naira on 300,000 is not big, right? But let's see you do it two times, three times, four times. Do you understand? In a day, that's when you see that any money you see, you, you, can, you can actually make 10% of your capital in a day. So that's just something you need to also understand and put into consideration. So guys, if you actually like this particular video that I shared here and understand it, please like, okay, and also subscribe, right? You are liking this in appreciation, right? And if you are subscribing here, just for you to follow me here on this particular channel because I share more updates on this particular kind of topic where you can make money doing simple crypto arbitrage, just buying low and sell high. I also have a Telegram community that you can join, okay? In that space, I share insights on, you know, different opportunities like this now. So I'll drop the link of that particular Telegram in the description so you can join us, okay? So, and also you can, you know, message me if you have any question there as well. If you want one on one mentorship, you can still message me right there, okay? So before I go, that is a video showing you here. That video is going to show you a coin that I'm going to buy in this next bull run season that's going to make you a lot of money, even if as a beginner. So I've explained everything in that particular video. So click on that video right now and watch how you can be able to make money right in this next bull run season with just my amount of money. Yeah, let's go, let's go, let's go. See it here, click on it. Yeah, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's go.